What's gonna be your inspiration for this piece? Well, my inspiration for this piece is for a lot of things, especially in a lot of a few days. So, um, first of all, it's therapeutic for me. All right. It keeps my mind busy at this point in time. All right. Um, secondly, uh, it's a little stamp that we can put in the community when we definitely need it. Um, it may be uh, a small milestone or a stone or a small pebble to a foundation that we need to stand on, but nevertheless, it's the start of something. All right. Um, and I'm here with my people. What would be inspiring you to do this piece? Well, I mean to piggyback off of uh, Nathan. Uh, things are getting kind of rough. I feel like we're going backwards a little bit. Um, it's not very necessary, but it's happening. So here we are. And I feel that we need we need to. Uh, we just have to remember. You know what I'm saying? We just have to remember how strong we are. You know what I'm saying? And if art is the way to do it, then let it be. By so, beautifying the neighborhood. That's it. We need we need a lot of inspiration right now because we don't need anybody getting weak on us now. Yeah, that's right. We got kids to worry about. We got grandparents, all the people to worry about. We gotta stay strong. All right. All right. Couple of seconds, Gary. So what's gonna be your inspiration for your piece? There's a lot going on now in America. Uh -huh. I think we got Right. Uh, we have to really focus on how we can have uh, peace. We're going to do a peace symbol. Okay. Go this flower and uh, somehow uh, bring that into the uh, community uh, as a whole All right. peace sign. And uh, we just want to um, bring our hearts to the whole, mission, the whole project. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for being part of this project with the New York Universal Visual Artists Uprising Organization. We're coming, uh, we have come a long way, as you can see. And now we're coming into Brooklyn. How you feel about that? <laughs> uh, I think it's, um, it's a nice um, evolution. You know, we have um, to bring our uh, tradition, our understanding of uh, life, and our struggle. We all come together and uh, unite. And, as artists you know, stand for a purpose. All right. Thank you. Hassan. What's up, bro? So what's going to be your inspiration for your piece that you're doing? Each one, teach one. All right. The tree of knowledge. You know All what I'm right. saying? We're trying to help the community, uplift the community. Empower the people to do the right thing. That's all we're trying to do. All right. All right. Thank you. You're welcome, brother.
so I got these Nathan Brown fronts, part of New York Universal Visual Artist Uprising. This is my piece that I wrote, uh, that I did here, and I did a collaboration with you want to go with this piece here. Um, here on the Brownsville, um, we wanted to uplift the community also with the uh, um, images that you see here that have a uh, significant meaning that represents us. Um, and, um, you know, I think the other people that worked with us, Michael, Joseph, Juan, um, uh, uh, <laughs> Gary, Jennifer, and everybody else that came along and, you know, um, participated in you know, put this work together. Um, it was a work of love, um, getting it together. We are definitely a group that uh, get together and do work that's not just art, it's life. And um, definitely appreciate being a part of this work and making history here and putting a mark on this world. Please. Gary Jean Jefferson. I'm one of the artists, one of the original artists of the group New York Universal Visual Artists Uprising. We've been painting since uh, 2014 together, and this is one of my original pieces of uh, lotus flower representing the Egyptian culture. Lotus represents long life and uh, eternity. I also have here at the end our logo for the organization, New York Universal Visual Artists Uprising. This is the mask, and in the mask mouth is a palette, and the palette represents all the colors. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is Jennifer Matthews. I'm part of the New York Universal Visual Artist Uprising. I'm out here in Brownsville, Brooklyn, New York, with uh, the rest of my team and um, here I have Queen Nefertiti I was inspired to paint her so that women in this community could feel more uh, empowered um, and more confident about who they are okay and then down here is my art with the help of Nathan and George and Sam uh, I was inspired to paint her because she is a symbol of balance of wisdom and these are feminine attributes of intelligence and these are things that we need in our lives to help push us forward to help move us forward in life and so I hope that the people in this community can feel enlightened Thank you. Wow. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Sam J. We're in Brooklyn, Brownsville at 315 Sutter Avenue. And we decided to do some murals to uplift the community. And the whole project is called Each One Teach One. And I, I decided to do a representation of Amun Ra, the sun god. And I drew the eagle, the, the sun, representing that. And this is part of my second mural. And this is a representation of Osiris with some hieroglyphics in the background.
and yeah, this is my first mural attempt, and I was really fortunate to be a part of this. I want to thank you. I want to thank George and Yusuf and everybody else. All the artists did a great job on this mural. Thank you guys. I really appreciate it. How you doing, everyone? My name is Juan Pagan, and we're here in Brownsville, uh, Brooklyn. Uh, this is this painting that I created on the on mural. It's a boat that represents uh, a journey, and once you take this journey, it'll show that it'll bring you to the next life once you pass on. Uh, I want to thank, uh, as a group collectively, we're working as artists uh, to, to, to make the community a lot brighter. Everyone's happy with it. I'm happy to be part of this project. And uh, again, my name is Juan Pagan, and thank you very much for this opportunity. Yeah, I'm George Torres, and uh, my piece, my section is um, Anubis, along with the three pyramids of Giza and the hieroglyphs of to unite and this is scattered. These are all um, images of like the afterlife but the message itself is to unite. Thank you. Peace. My name is Abu Yusuf Hassan Falero. Just want to show you that this piece right here, it means the woman means strength, the scorpion queen, which is strength and also beauty. Over here is the piece which is called the Ankh, which represents everlasting life. This is one of my pieces over here, which is a minotep, an Egyptian scientist or physician. Now, basically, we did this program here, this little project was basically done for the community so that it can empower the people. That's one of the reasons why we came here. And the, the theme of the, uh, the mural is each one teach one. You know, and this is what we want to instill in the, the hearts of our people and the minds of our people, especially the young. Peace and love. Great work 
It is only the beginning of the first wall, and I fear that it's going to be on every wall in Lansing development. So we look forward to continuing this partnership. And thank you to the Brownsville Community Solutions placemaking, um, uh, placemaking manager, Ms. Lee, who has made this possible. Without the support of organizations like Brownsville Community Solutions, these projects cannot be possible. Artists cannot just give away their talents. They have to be supported. And thank you for sharing that talent. Not only not have this mural 
sorry, that's a double negative and that cancels it out. But uh, she, along with Ms. Carrington, who was the executive director of the Langston Hughes Senior Center, but is now leading the Roswell Group Collective, these two are the reasons why reasons why murals are popping up around Langston Hughes. The mural on this building, the mural on what is that? 335. Uh, the murals on that basketball board on just all over. It's because of these two ladies because they saw that they had that vision and they're, they're giving us the opportunity today. So thank you so much. Thank, thank you. 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 Thank Got everybody? Uh, no, I gotta come Please back. Come back. Make sure you got everybody. Yeah, make sure everybody drops it as soon as I cut it. Okay. Alrighty. Okay.